Hey guys, what's going on? Leslie here, or Lyrical Persuasion, and today I'm bringing you guys my first ever Warframe multiplayer gameplay. Um, this was actually a 17 minute game, but I slowed it, well not slowed it, I sped it up so it can be under 5 minutes. Because what I want to talk about is not going to take so freaking long to do it. Um, so like I said, I'm bringing you some Warframe on the PS4. If you haven't downloaded it yet, go download it. Um, I know in this game, you're going to see me doing weird and crazy things, but I never played this game before. I don't know the concept behind this game, and I was just like, what the hell are we doing? So it took me a while to find the battleship for us in order to clear the level, and uh, I think they were trying to talk to me, but I didn't have my headset on. So yeah, but anyways, but what's this I hear about freaking Walmart becoming the new GameStop and freaking what's another used game store? I don't know. Uh, Best Buy, like like everybody, every industry, like every company is starting to try to dip into everybody little bit of business that they're trying to get. Now Walmart is this big corporate um, headquarters franchise, whatever you want to call it. They've already got several things out there. Um, now they got this where you can trade in video games and then you get gift cards for trading it in. Like uh, I don't think so. That's pretty stupid. Um, first of all, if you're gonna do, I think that if you're gonna go ahead and make it to where we trade in our video games, um, to you guys, maybe we don't want to shop at your store. Okay, Walmart's a good store, but I mean, like, what if we want cash for it? Like, I don't like the used places where you get the cash for it, but we don't get cash for it. You give us gift cards and shit. Like, we want gift cards, and if we don't want the gift cards and we want cash, you give us less than what we would have gotten for in-store credit. Like, dude, are you freaking kidding me? Um, so I think that this, um, used game thing is not going to last long as far as Walmart goes. Now, I'm not going to say that people aren't going to go try it. I'm sure as hell ain't going to try it because I already know that um, if I do try to trade in the game, say for instance, if I went out and bought um, what's the new game that's out right now? Infamous Second Son. And I was like, alright, I beat the campaign, and now I'm ready to go ahead and trade it in. Walmart says, alright, you bring it to us, we'll give you $30 for it. Are you fucking kidding me? This shit just came out two weeks ago. Like, why would you give me no? I'm not getting no in-store credit from you. Um, if they were to say... Um, I'll give you, how about, I'll meet you halfway, I'll give you about $45 in cash if you give me the game. I'm like, okay, I'll do that if you give me $45 in cash, not $30 in freaking in-store credit. Because like I said, there's not too many things that you could buy at Walmart. Okay, of course, you can go and buy another video game, but then it's like, dude, I just, no. Like I said before, I don't think it's going to last long as far as the um, going in and trading in the games for a special value. Um, GameStop is getting ridiculous. I don't even shop there no more when it comes to games. Sometimes when I do a promotion, like my birthday now, I think they gave me 20% off or 40% off, something like that for my birthday. So I might use that to go get my damn uh, video game from them. But other than that, I don't shop at GameStop. I had an incident like a few years back, back in 2010 with GameStop, so about four years ago. And I was like, ah, I'm not shopping with you guys anymore. And the only time I do it, like I said before is to get pre-owned stuff when they give me like coupons to get like uh discount on games because i get all my games from best buy because i'm in the gamers club unlocked or on uh best buy where i get like 20 percent off video games i had to pay 200 bucks for two years to get 20 percent off of brand new games so yeah i'm in the best buy club so i don't really need gamestop anymore so let me know in the comment section below do you think walmart is smart for doing this or do you think that it's a good idea but we should be able to get cash too if we put the game value in i mean as walmart store gift card i don't like i said what are you gonna do buy groceries with that shit like nah now, nah, what's next? They're going to start taking pre-owned movies. Okay, if I take my movies in there, like my DVDs and stuff, and trade, upgrade, and save, then I'll do that. Like, because I need to upgrade some of my DVDs to Blu-rays. So, I'll do that. When it comes to the games, no. No. But, uh, anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this topic. Like I said in the comment section below, let me know how you feel about Walmart and this new thing that they're trying. They started out yesterday, which was March 26. Um, so, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to tomahawk that like button and subscribe for more videos to come. And I will talk to you guys later. Have a good day, everyone.